Our robot-controlled armies becoming a reality? An alarming warning from hacker group DeadSec was released earlier today. DeadSec revealed footage taken from inside the top secret facility that showed the technology being prepped to deal with rioters. The hackers released information that military technology company Titus has been redirecting taxpayer dollars in their research funding to build militarized robots that would be used in domestic policing. So far, there has been no comment from Titus. Followers think nailing thrust is the big win here, but it's only the frosting on the cake. Yeah, people are going to be doubting their own opinions now. Nobody's going to admit to getting played with this election, but every pro-thrust voter is now wondering if they were. We've welded Bloom and the CTOS to the idea that big data is invasive and shitty. Yep. One big invasive shitty cake. <laughs> You're terrible. You love it. You need to shut them down. Prioritize them as a threat. Something. Yep. It's gone on for too long. Oh, I heard you, Mary. The first motherfucking dozen times. If you did, we wouldn't be here, am I right? What's going on? What? Conspiracy? And did he darken my picture? Hey, Ray, can you scrub this shit? Yeah, well, it's not gonna be that easy this time. Looks like the douche has made you a federal problem. Welcome to the club, amigo. Yeah, it's what he wanted all along, right? Set us up as the boogeyman terrorizing Silicon Valley? Dushan offers to protect them with the CTOS and the satellite backbone, and bam, everybody falls right in line. Yeah, now Bloom has access to all that collected data, feeding the damn bellwether. Shit, it's like they got a wider reach than the NSA now. I bet the NSA will be real interested in cozying up to them now. The NSA will encourage other corporations to keep spreading their legs for Bloom. Mm, I gotta do something. I can't stay here uh -uh. stuck. No way. That is exactly... What do you wants? Besides, you've been doing a lot of the heavy lifting so far. Time to share a load before your back breaks. All right. All right, you guys take the field. I'll provide you logistics. Let's make this happen. Hey, you gave me that look again. Are we okay? Marcus is in serious trouble. Yeah, so let me help. I'm not the bad guy here, Satara. I get it, okay? But we don't use each other here. That's primate. That's Silicon Valley. Are you guys cool over there? Yeah, we're cool. No, we're good. Where do you need me? Hmm? <sighs> Go help Marcus. Take him out. Meet Andrew Novak, Dushin's assistant. Oh, poor bastard. He's been stealing proprietary data for his new one true love, Mary Cat skills. The CEO? Dumb bastard. I'm gonna hack his laptop, use his back door to get me inside Bloom's private cluster, and score the code we need. But to do that, 
I'm gonna need to stretch my legs first. Yo, Marcus! Play me something fresh. I'm gonna need to find a way up if I'm gonna disrupt the local CTOS router. Damn. Bloom really goes that extra mile to protect its own. go. And I'm in. If he finds out, I'll never work in tech again. That's the least of your problems, dear. Dushan will track down your family and get them fired, too. He's very high noon justice that way. Jesus! You're not helping! <laughs> Andrew, my door is always open. You know that. I don't plan on being an assistant forever, Mary. No, hon. Not as my assistant. You betrayed Duchenne. For you! And legal and HR will never let you come aboard. Your lawsuit waiting to happen. Fuck! Then what are we talking about? Weren't you the one who wanted to turn our arrangement into something more? 24-7? Yeah. Collar and chastity cage, pegging, breath control. 50s household, but I wear the pants and you take care of my state. That's... an option? I'll send the contract over. I have to run, but you think about it. I scored the access code. Grinch, you're up. Locating Bloom's backup data farm and nuking this sound. You'll get to break all the shit you want. That site's pulling in way too much power, hombre. And it's on Bloom's doorstep. So go flex some muscles! Destroy the backup servers or they'll just default to a previous version of the data we're about to wipe.
lost. Hey Marcus, does this room look small to you? Man, I'm not there. Yep, looks small to me too. Unlocks. I'll unlock it. You keep your eyes open. Finding cover!
found the backup servers? Dude, I found Bloom's utility closet, the backup servers, and the campus generators. Good thing I brought extra goodies. There are 73 Marcus Holloways walking around right now, and we're spamming more. I can't print Yermi masks with your face on it fast enough for people. CTOS facial rec is going nuts trying to respond. It's safe for you to move around now. I'll do good. Sending you the code to get inside. Dushin's assistant doesn't know he's been hacked. You'll have no surprises. Once you access Bloom's air gap computer, transmit everything through your phone and relay the intel back to the mothership. Good luck, Buckaroo. Got the game on lock like we changed the key. What? Danny Brown. Who? Man, fuck all y'all. Oh, shit. Ray. You're gonna need to shut down their ability to warn the douche. You got ideas? Exploit the campus routers and change their password. That'll lock down their Wi-Fi to everyone except us. Hustle bustle. I'm on Overwatch. <laughs> First one's down. Bingo. Find the next one. Careful. Take 
Get him down, now! Another router bites the dust. That's it. They're cut off, and so is Dusan. You doing okay, Ray? Just be careful. Now don't worry about me. Just find a way down. Damn it! Do a Outside with our ride. You safe? Yeah. Fucking chaps my sack that I'm not in there with you, but I'm safe. I know, man. I'm closing in on the air gap computer.
I'm through the door. And I got the car seats warmed up. Ready when you are. Ray, you seriously need to see this place. Man, don't tell me that. My heart's breaking here. Breaking. Man, last time I tried this, Dushan Nimic happened. He's not there, trust me. Which is a real fucking pity. <laughs> yeah, I'll still keep my fingers crossed. Kind of unsettling that there are no guards down here. I'm using the admin cert that Josh scored to get into their guts. You guys getting this? We've got access to the air gap computer. It's no longer off the grid. Downloading what we need. Shit, they definitely didn't like that. You watch yourself, amigo. You're still not topside. You can't win! Damn it! I'm at the elevator. The engine's purring. Satara, we're coming back, but me and Ray have one more stop to make. You're invisible again. Thanks. I'm heading out, Ray. Let's lock this up. The second thorn in Bloom's side is no stranger to most of us, Mr. Raymond Kenny. Though Kenny was a CTOS pioneer, he was also a whistleblower who decided to turn on his own team. He was unsuccessful. His response took out the Northeast power grid, leaving 11 people dead. Collateral damage. Kenny went underground soon after, and although we've been working very closely with law enforcement, he has remained one step ahead of us ever since. We almost caught him in Pawnee, Illinois, where he posed as a sculptor named T-Bone to set up camp near one of our main offices. He gave us the slip. Raymond Kenny's primary goal seems to be an end to our company which leads us to believe he is mentally unstable. Indeed, he has often allied with other troubled minds, including Eden Pierce, and another former Bloom engineer, Tobias Frewer. We believe Kenny is an active threat, and we expect he will try to attack CTOS 2.0. Keep in mind, Kenny is a master manipulator, operates at a high level of expertise, and has extensive knowledge about our company. Our own employees have been tricked into letting him through our doors on multiple occasions. The current plan for dealing with Raymond Kenny is to have a proper response waiting for him, because he will strike again. You'll note, we recently sent pictures of him in the employee newsletter to try to build awareness.
What's good, homie? Marcus? I have to say, I don't really see the win in you coming here, but... Oh, wait. Wait, wait, wait. This isn't some petty macho bullshit, is it? Hi, could you stop us if it was? What, you an Encino man here? I don't know, I'm liking my odds. Fucking Vegas is liking my odds. Yeah, Encino man here. I know who the fossil is. I've been elbow deep in Ray Kenny's head, massaging his code, improving it, overriding it. But I got to give you some props, though. You had chops for someone that was clicking two rocks together. Kudos to you. <laughs> well, don't go getting all hard on my account, Duchenne. This isn't exactly what you call a social visit. It's more of a, wouldn't you say? Fuck them and leave them situation. Yeah, that, <laughs> right. Right, well, I'm always up for a fucking run, but... Why the hell are you here? Oh, man, it, it could be important. But let me, uh, let me tell you a story. Uh, our story. Everything you've done, it's all out there now. Violating the public trust. Manipulating the stock markets, the lies, the fraud. Fucking bellwether. All of it. You're bluffing. What happens if you actually answer it this time? Maybe it's Bloom sending you to face the firing squad alone. Or maybe it's your lawyer telling you there's no place to run. Maybe it's just a telemarketer. You really should answer it this time. Whoever it is, you're done fucking people over. Silent. Hacker. It's a switch on your fears, fear of the other. tried to isolate you. It's called divide and conquer. And they tricked you into thinking it's what you asked for. If you're going to, San Francisco, you're going to, to keep you controlled and ignorant. They use CTOS to track you, to predict your behavior, to keep you in your place. They lied to you, and we promised to expose them and show you the truth. We invited you to join us, and you did. You said with one voice, we will not be lied to. We will not be afraid. We will not be silent. In the streets, yeah, <laughs> thanks. So long. Uh, <laughs> Let's see what the world looks like when we aren't afraid to stand together. San Francisco hacktivist cell DeadSec has allegedly revealed what might be the biggest scandal in Silicon Valley yet. The hackers exposed evidence that Bloom's chief technology officer, Dushan Nemec, was abusing his access to CTOS data for his own financial and political gain. Nemec was taken into custody and is facing numerous counts of fraud, while authorities have begun seizing his accounts. Bloom's PR representative Charlotte Gardner said they are as shocked as anyone and are looking into the matter while cooperating with authorities. Evidence highlighted by DedSec could put Nemec in jail for a very long time.